Emmanuel Macron has, in some ways, decided to respect protocol today by indeed uh, having his prime minister announced here at the Elysee Palace as the tradition goes. Now, there are some differences, though. The first and main one is probably the fact that this uh, new prime minister is from the opposition Les Républicains Party, yet he is a conservative. And the objective with this decision by uh, Emmanuel Macron is most certainly uh, to give a nod to the voters and also the local members of this party in order to press them to join his movement and, uh, indeed, to help him win the parliamentary elections that are due this June here in France. Now, uh, there is another breach in protocol, and that is the fact that uh, the uh, chief of staff of the Elysee Palace here did not give uh, the composition of the whole government, but only the prime minister. Usually, it is the whole government that is announced here on these steps, and we will not know the composition of that full government till tomorrow. But we do have some clues. We know that he wants parity, he wants as many men as women, and he also also wants 50 percent of new faces, members of what we call here in France the civil society, basically non-professional politicians that should be joining the government. The first cabinet meeting will take place on Wednesday.